All right, guys, welcome back. We're finally here. Today marks the very beginning of an extremely historical moment in the world of video games. Okay, we've been waiting for this for many, many years. And it's finally here. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dying Light 2. We're going to be tackling the main story of this game. And before we get any further, I have to give a huge thank you to my really good friends over at Techland for providing me early access to this game. Honestly, one of the kindest people to work with. And I'm, I'm so grateful to be a part of these creators that have been chosen to bring these videos out early. And um, I just, I, I feel great. And I hope for this game to do phenomenal. And I truly wish them the best. Thank you guys for being here. A huge thank you to all of you who supported the first video that we did based on a side quest that is currently sitting at over 1.5 million views. And a lot of you are asking me, dude, is this a side quest? Because it feels like a main story mission. You can tell that a lot of hard work and dedication and love and passion went into this. And I'm just, I'm just so excited. So I'm going to shut up, sit back, relax. And if you want a full series ASAP, every day, all day, just drop a like on this video. Let's do this. Civilization is a vulnerable thing, a whim of circumstance. At any time, the smallest flap of a butterfly's wings may set catastrophe in motion. Haran, an entire city wiped from the map. Those left behind there did not stand a chance. The world's greatest minds came together and found a vaccine against the Haran virus. Finally, mankind had prevailed against the disease. But people always want more. Damn. Despite a promise to shutter its labs, the GRE continued its research in secrecy for military purposes. Of course. It didn't take long for a variant of THV to escape into the world once more. The fall happened more rapidly than anyone could have predicted. Dude. <laughs> I'm so excited, bro. Oh, I'm so excited, dude. Imagine we visit Haran eventually. That would be The sick. few who survived now live in small enclaves. The only means of contact between distant human settlements are lone individuals, brave or desperate enough to travel on their own across dangerous wastelands. They are known as pilgrims. Somewhere on the map, one city is still standing. Oh, A city isolated from the outside world. A city with special rules. Now, it's the last bastion of humanity. Oh my god, this is gonna be so freaking sick. A chance for us to learn from history. And for once, make the right choices. Let's go. Because every choice you make here shapes the future. Yo, let's go. Irreversibly. Dude, I'm just pumped, bro. I'm sorry. I'm just excited. Oh boy, here we go. 2036. 15 years after the fall. Dude, I'm so freaking excited for this story. Oh my goodness. Here we go, boys and girls. Let's go. Starting off with some good old hardcore parkour. That's right. And of course, we've got Zam. After us. Woo shit. Uh, yeah, last time I checked, y'all yeah, don't do parkour, all right? Let's just let's keep it that way. My own sanity, damn it. Let's calm down. Woo. Uh, that's a view. That's. You still got it. You know, this game used to be more fun. <laughs> you used to be younger. I'm dumber. 
What matters is you still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim yeah, is a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. A new story quest. A, pilgr a pilgrim's path. Climb to the ledge. Did I tell you guys already how, how, how excited I am for this crap? Oh my god, look at this. Look at the scenery. And believe it or not, it's hard to say, but it's hard to believe, better yet. Look at them over there. The graphics are actually improved from Dying Light 1. They're very good. Well, look at the ledge. Jump towards it. With RB to grab it. Hold RB to jump further. So you've got the small jump and then the big jump forward. Which is nice. Shit, man. You're still strong. What's up, Spike? Let's go. Oh god. Man. Thanks. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. But don't get all mushy on me now. Come. I want to show you something. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. Oh, you've been kicking around for what? Four years now? And you're still alive. So are you. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, right. Seriously, I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, uh, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts left and a ramshackle fence. <laughs> Look at that. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste. Uh, no way. Ooh, look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here too. Alright, so... Objective updated. Collect honey and chamomile. We'll search it up. Hold R to use your... Oh, the survivor sense on this game is so much better. Because you just hold the uh, right stick. I love it. Over here. Grab some more. Yeah, this will do. Alright, nice. Grab a couple extra just in case. Never know. Alright, let's go back down. Do you remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh, yeah, the one that had that saying, uh, remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you, you just might go on living. So we've got the medicine blueprint. All right, craft a healing medicine. You've received a new blueprint. So press to go back to the crafting menu. So here we've got the crafting menu. Blueprints are plans that allow you to create accessories, consumables, and weapon modifications using various crafting parts. Scavenged during your exploration. So, this is the storage area where all of your craft parts are collected. Read the craft part description to see how, you're, or how they're used uh, and where you can find them. Now, hover over to the medicine blueprint and hold A to craft it. Perfect. So, here... Is all the uh, craft parts and we can also find info about them and here's your blueprints so max craft I'm gonna go ahead and just do one we can only do one actually <laughs> and then we've just made medicine now we've got the first upgrade level so upgrade level one heals for 50 time to apply four seconds amount produced one come on we almost there. All right, follow Spike. So up on the D-pad to take the uh, medicine we just crafted. Where's the flashlight? I forgot. All right. This is it. Come on. Man, are you sure we're safe here? This, this don't look too safe. I'm just, just saying. Ooh, yeah, I don't like this. Spike, you're going crazy on me, man. What's, what's wow. going on here? <laughs> Somebody had a nice crib. Nice crib. <laughs> Damn it, locked. I'll try to get through here. 
You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. All right, so let's see. Can we uh, search these vehicles? They've been abandoned for too long. All right, we can definitely go down here. Ooh, this is looking spooky. Okay, ooh, there's a lot of stuff here. Oh man, look at that bike, man. Once upon a time, a nice family lived here. But that is once upon a time. Or that was once upon a time. I need some first aid. Empty. Of course. Why would there be a free first aid there? Ooh, got some leather. Okay, calm down, okay? Just I'm not here to hurt nobody. Just, nothing here. Just please don't sneak up on me. I just, Nothing in here. Ooh, what is that? Rags. And here we've got a soap. <laughs> soap. Excellent. All right, so hold on. Before I... I'm obviously supposed to be for sure. It's quite obvious we're supposed to um investigate the red. Uh... What's going on in here? Hold up. Bro, look at the, the scenery in this. Oh, okay. All right. What the? Hey, everything all right? Yeah, just rats. I think it's time we parted ways. Why? I'm starting to worry about you. And you know our saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. Hold on. Only been like 10 minutes into this already getting jump scared here. What's going on here, man? Got some rice. Oh. Resin. What else? Was there anything else in here? No. Okay, so let's go ahead and search this up. Party. Uh, wow. But by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. Wow, the last spring party 2023. Wait, are you telling me we got one more year to live? You know, based on how the world is going, this this seems quite accurate and it's making me nervous. What does Techland know that we don't? Huh? Five years later, who remembers Oran? Aw, oh, dude. Oran was insane, bro. Let's keep, uh, hold on. Before I do the, the red ones, the magnifying glass, I know that those, those are probably going to trigger something. So let's see if I can get as much as I possibly can at the moment. What is this? More resin. Ooh. Cigarettes. Smoking my cancer. All right. What do we got here? Some scraps. I'll take me some scraps. Not a zip. What's down here? Oh, that's too high. Okay. All right. So I'm going to go back here. We're going to take a look at the magnifying glass. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. This suit's got a voice. It's very similar to Cranes mixed with like Troy Baker's. Uh, was that his name, Troy Baker? I could be a little bit off on that. Um, Joel, basically. It's pretty interesting. Is that weird that I like Who his voice? Who do you voodoo? <laughs> Sounds familiar. Who do you voodoo, bitch? Oh, man, the little Easter egg. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my God. And that's what they called art. That's awesome. What are you voodoo bitch? That's from freaking. Oh my God. Dead Island. I'm horrible with names. Oh my God. Whoa.
heartbreaking. There's nothing like a party to celebrate the end of the world. Uh, they died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky too. <sighs> I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. Hey, man. That's that's tough. Explore the garden. Oh my lord, these guys. So so that's basically what the party uh, flyers were for. These guys were throwing a end of the world party, a going away forever party. They knew they were gonna die. Listen, I don't want to get emotional, but that's some sad shit. That's this is brilliant writing. Oh gosh. I'm a sucker for when it comes to things like this, man. Oh no. At least they had each other. She was classy. <laughs> she was classy. Dude, this is insane. Like, literally, this is the opening of the game, and they're like, it's giving me really intense vibes right now. I'm like, sad. <laughs> Fuck. Is that one of the devs? Or all of them, for that matter. Dearest Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Hey, come here. Check this out. I'm already obsessed. Goodbye letter. If these are the devs, I <laughs> how you doing? <laughs> Thank you for making this game happen, I guess we can say, right? At some point we thought it was never gonna happen. Damn it, we got it. Let's just make sure there's nothing hidden here or anything like that. Bro, this is... Wow, man. I mean, I'd be happy dying right here. Just so peaceful. Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? No, A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it by the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Here. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Yeah, at least until night falls. True. <sighs> I wish Crane could have seen this. Wh who? Doesn't matter. <gasps> I tracked down that guy for you. Ah, shit. <laughs> they just mentioned our boy Crane and we just literally played the following and we just finished the story. Oh shit, man. It's it's still fresh in my bones, so you know. Uh why didn't you say that earlier? What guy? Hey, what 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 guy? Quit pretending. You became a pilgrim to track that fucker down. Waltz. I found someone who knows him. Hey, what? And you're only telling me now? Huh, when I tossed you a beer, thought you'd guess right away we were celebrating. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly he knows something about Waltz. Villador. I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I got a favor to ask you. 
You deliver this to Gary? It's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. <laughs> and where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. But when something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected, then suddenly they're knocking on our doors. All right. But you owe me one. No, not just one. So what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Told him he'd hear from you soon. Hmm. I'll just go straight to the city. It's not that simple. Villador was supposed to be one of the zones. Cities that were walled off to keep out the plague. The plan fucked up. But this city, and its walls, survived. But this guy knows a way in. Get in touch with him, and he'll tell you everything. What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes racing me, and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe, well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. Eyes? I was gonna say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. <laughs> because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're gonna live there. No one's gonna drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. I hope he gets that. I hope re I really do hope Spike gets that. That'd be cool to see. And that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah. Yeah, one day. Well, <sighs> my time's up. So when will I see you again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy. Or whoever you're looking for. And remember... 140.200 megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you. Out of the radio antenna. Wow. Sensational. Absol Ow! Absolutely incredible. Well, I will say I'm gonna miss this place. Um, a lot of emotions ran through me as I was just playing that section. That was that was phenomenal. I, I like what they did there. That was really, really good. Kind of takes you back. I don't know. It's, it was good. It was really, really good. Jesus, that was good. This is this is good. This is good, man. This is fucking phenomenal. Let's go, baby. Okay, hold to check your current objective on the extended HUD. Okay, go to the radio antenna. I mean, I know this, man. Come on. I'm not that dumb. Follow the trail here. Ooh. Oh, what do we got here? More chamomile. And we've got... I'm actually surprised I'm not getting stung by bees to death. <laughs> we can't slide in this game, which is something I've noticed. I'm hoping that this is something that we can probably upgrade to later on. Hmm. So we can go over there. Or we can just be uh, a little bold and woohoo! Let's go. Dive and surface. Hold on, let me see what's in here. What is that? Oh, a raggedy chopper. Long axe. Okay, so how do I... 
Hold up. Hold on. Very nice. I will say that it's probably better than the bat. Right, hold up. We've got some got some dead down here. I see them. I smell them. Ah, biters. Really? Really? Are you really just gonna... Jesus Christ, woman. Calm down. She had absolutely nothing for me. Alright, hold on. We've got some camel mill here. And... I'm gonna take this. Let me see if I can open this door up. Hold up. Yes, we can. More resin. Oof. I'm about, can I open that door? Back here? No. Oh, God. God. Alright, great. Should be able to get a good amount of things here. We got some, <laughs> some some tin cans. Very nice. Die, bitch. So all of them are dead. That's that's always good. I'm gonna search them up. Thank you. I'm gonna get as much of uh, these as I possibly can. You never know when you're gonna need them. How about in the back of the house? Is there something there? Possibly a crate or something? No. Okay, well, that's that's good. I guess. Oh, what is this? Or a camel mill. Oh, that's gonna be great. So it seems like there's a lot of ca camel mills. It's just the uh, little honeys, uh, honey, uh, I guess honey, that we, we need to find, which is a little bit more rare. Anything underwater? Am I exploring too much right now? I'm sorry. I'm just, just, just pump, bro. Right, let's go. One thing that I'm really concerned about in this game is the the uh, stamina during climbing that's i feel like that's gonna bite me in the ass a lot especially when we're running away and doing some parkour and we're nervous as hell uh yeah see just like that oh god this is gonna be the death of me i'm i'm, I'm telling you right now maybe i should have just gone straight up that's probably what it yeah. Alright. Nice. Alright, cool. Let's go in here. What do we got in here? Anything good? No? Alright, no problem. For those of you asking, the parkour still feels insanely good. Even better, actually. Don't forget, uh, or don't get close to the biters. Oh, God. What, you mean don't get close to, like, the 100 freaking dead zombies down here, huh? All right. Got it. Copish. I'm not even going to even consider uh, searching any of these vehicles. That, that'll be, honestly... Perhaps the dumbest thing to do right now. All right, perfect. I think we're in the clear. Oh, God. Okay, we're in the clear. No, actually, no. No. Oh, throw. Oh, to ignite? No way. Hold on. Let me, let me try this. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. That was awesome. So 
welcome to... Can I climb up that one? Let me go through this one. Welcome to Misty Forest. That was great. see what's going on we're gonna have to leap over those logs hanging on the wall and we've got more honey this is phenomenal by the way I'm gonna go here let's check this out this is our um, this is our, our character our main character I don't think I really have anything um, to put on him yet we're basically all defaults but I did want to go to the crafting I want to craft max amounts of medicine which is how much? Four. Oh, dude, I almost missed that. All right, good. What is this? More chamomile? And we've got another honey here. Excellent. You have no idea how good it is to have actually because in Dying Light 1, like we did this screen right here, like we didn't have this. Like this one, the inventory screen. We didn't have that. Like if you press back, you just kind of pause the game. Or I, actually, I think you went to the uh, to the map or, or something. There is a, a couple of new things within this game that really are nice. Woohoo! Alrighty. Keep going here. I'm really just trying to get as much health as as it's possibly given to me at the moment. I don't know how scarce that's gonna be moving forward, but I'm trying to take full advantage of it right now. Oh shit. Hiya! So sorry dude. So you block with LB and then to kick you hold RB while or R RT while holding LB. I think I like the kicking better in, in Dying Light 1 uh, just because it was one button. But it's fine. I'm sure it's all a matter of getting used to it. What the fuck was that? Let's go, baby. Parkour level up. So, you've acquired a new parkour skill. What are the skills menu? Here we go. So, this is a skills tab. We've got combat points and parkour points. So, you've leveled up your parkour proficiency and earned yourself uh, your first parkour skill points. You can now use it to unlock your first parkour skill. Okay, so what's it going to be? The high jump allows you to reach higher ledges when you hold RB while jumping. Hover over a skill icon. So, now we can jump even higher. Excellent. Perfect. Almost there. Ah, oh, nice. And as you can see there on the on the right, we we get those points. Uh, those extra points for for using these skills. Watch, watch. You see it there. You see plus one, plus two, plus three, plus four. That's nice. I think we've arrived, boys. Oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide somewhere for the night. It won't get any better than this. Um, I'm gonna hide somewhere. Oh Jesus. Um, you expect me? Ooh, right through this pool. On the drain pipe. Uh, drain pipe. A drain pipe. Excuse me. The broadcast station should be here somewhere. Nice. Is that a... Okay, never mind. That's outside. Okay, that's to leave. Ooh, you got some footsteps. Uh, raggedy chop, uh, chopper. Is this a door? Oh, it's closed. Hmm. 
Someone moved them. Not long ago. It's been moved. Mm, I see what's happening. Okay, let's give it a try. We'll search for a safe place to sleep, huh? And then we gotta wait. Um, oh, shit! It. Let's go! The broadcast station. I gotta start the generator. Of course. Why why wouldn't we have to start the generator? Now I gotta go back outside and hmm. I don't think we can use it, right? We don't have power. Oh, it's dead. I need to connect it to power. Typical. Alright, let's go back out. So how do we Oh no, that was locked. My bad. <laughs> Sorry. Ow. Generator's here. All right, so turn on the power. Okay. What the? Well, that's great. Phenomenal. Sensational. Absolutely perfect news. What the hell is that? Bro, that is creepy, dude. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my god. Um, combat basics. So, some enemies use power attacks that do massive damage and can knock you down. When the enemy is about to use a power attack, his health bar starts blinking red. Dodge to avoid being hit. Perform the dodge. Okay. That doesn't even sound right. Oh, God. Oh, I got him. Perfect dodge. Honestly? Okay. You guys are starting to piss me off. Yo, what the freaking... Alright, where's that one freaking... Did he... Did I kill it? That was close. Oh, I killed it. Wait, where did I kill? Are you kidding me? There was a. Oh, there was one of those. Oh, here it is. Man, I didn't even. I didn't even know I killed it. All right, so now we got some peace and tranquility. You've collected craft master resources. Use uh, them at the craft master. All right, let's. Let, let me see. Craft, uh... Oh, the craft. Okay, we don't have that here. Perfect. All right, let's turn this on. Should be able to do this now. Thank you very much. Nice. Ah, so it was actually, um, if you see there, it was paint. It wasn't blood. I thought it was blood. Um, let me see. Some scraps. All right, good. Let me go this way and see if I can, um, ooh, that is quite disgusting. Let me see if I can loot this here. All right, we've got some gold. Oh, those are the gold coins that we can use to distract the uh, the dead. Interesting. Okay, so where's the room that we were at? Was it here? Ah, oh, this is that room we couldn't open. Now we can... Okay. So we can go downstairs like a normal human. Instead of jumping down the windows all the time. That's excellent. All right, so we should be able to... 
safe zones or safe areas. You've just unlocked the first safe zone, increasing your network of respawn points. So all safe zones are equipped with a UV light, which guarantees safety at night. Additionally, each safe zone offers access to a resting place where you can change the day night phases and Aiden's stash where you can leave your access items. Nice. All right, so can we, uh, let me see, possibly use this later or in the morning? Okay, let's roll. We got a little, little microphone there and everything. So I think he said uh, 140.2, right? Yeah, he did. Uh, this is Aiden, over. Anyone there looking for a pilgrim? Over. Uh, I guess I have to wait until morning. Yeah. He did say dawn. I'm an absolute fool. Uh, enough of that. Time to sleep. I'll try again in the morning. All right, so let's go ahead and see what is this i know i have a lot of the weapons that are better than this but i'm just getting them so i can sell them once we get to to an area in which we can sell and buy stuff so that's going to come in handy get some extra cash if you will Aiden. mia Aiden, Aiden. are we running or what but like now no, we're old. No, Aidy. We need supplies. Everything's ready. It's so quiet. Where is everyone? Maybe they're all dead. <laughs> You're stupid. Let's go. <clears throat> now. Be all right. Wait here. This guy was a. Uh... will come of this. Have you brought twelve, three, four, six? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry, they'll let us go soon. Baby, I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. I know. This is super interesting. Oh my god. We're foster kids, or we're experiments, or. Us, this is how we'll always find each other. Uh, Aiden! Not him, no! Mia! Aiden! Dr. Waltz, we won't make it. The military will be here any moment. Wait. Close your eyes. Oh, God. Wow. This is getting really interesting, man. Holy smokes. Fire! Fire in the lab! definitely gonna be having some more of those dreams for sure oh this is getting good it's getting really good 
I wonder if we uh that's like our main thing to find her. Like maybe we lost time each to other. contact the guy Spike was talking about. Okay, here we go. This is Aiden. I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? It, yes. I was supposed to get in touch with you. I thought you'd change your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. I just want to find Mia. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I... Can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnels through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. Interesting. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris, and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I'm going to the rendezvous. I'll see you later, Aiden. Oh, snap. Meet the contact in the metro tunnels. All right. Let's do it. Oh, well, well. Look what we got here. I don't think we can go up. Can we go up there? I think we can. That would be interesting. Hold on. I wonder if we go up there, we find something. Wait, how in the world? Well, at least I didn't have to climb to the top of this antenna. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me let me check this area out. Oh, we could climb this crap. Oh my lord. Wait, how am I gonna climb this? I don't have stamina for this. Uh we're gonna die. And we d <laughs> You know what? I think we're gonna skip the tower. Alright, we're just gonna, we're gonna skip the tower. We're just gonna go straight down here. I can't keep like just admiring the view in this game. Woohoo! Got some fresh air in my butt crack. And it feels good. All right, I'm gonna stop. Now, right, what do we have here? Ooh, we got 29 points for uh, parkour. We've got some honey. Nice. And <laughs> also chamomile. So every time you search, it doesn't technically, doesn't necessarily mean that it's gonna give you. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, God is dead. That's Paradise Lost Book Four. Hold on. So journal. Um collectibles. Um So this is Paradise Lost. This is the letter we wrote and this is the newspaper. Interesting. 5 years later, who remembers Haran? Is there any hope left for the thousands of people who trapped in Haran? 5 years have passed since the city of Haran was isolated from the rest of the world. Residents who thought they'd found the refuge from the virus now found themselves in, the, in a death trap. Fending for themselves and denied aid from the outside, why did the world turn its back on Haran? Can a once thriving city and its thousands of residents simply be erased from history? Damn, that's intense. And this is what we just found. So, Paradise Lost, Book 4, Abish the Devil stood and felt how awful godness is, or goodness is, and saw virtue in her shape how lovely saw and pined his loss but chiefly to find her uh find he observed his luster visibly impaired yet seemed undaunted i read that incredibly horrible and i'm not even going to uh talk about it okay let's not talk about this let's keep going uh 
I thought that statue was gonna pull up on me, bro. I was ready to do some damage. <laughs> ready to do some damage, bro. Here we go. Shit. Woo. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right, so I think this is actually inside. As long as there's no like dead fighters in here. Another mm, nine coins. Excellent. We got it all. I think we got it all. Oh shoot! We gotta go up. We gotta go up. We gotta go up. Oh my god! I almost died. I'm trying to, for the first episode, I'm trying to do as much as I possibly can. Like, you know, I don't have to loot everything. I know that. But I'm not trying to rush it either. You know what I mean? Especially on the first episode. That would be like a disservice to the game. Hello? It's Aiden. Can you hear me now? Loud and clear. That means you must be close. I swam across the lake. So, you almost reached the tunnel. GRE left when they sealed off the city. I'm coming from the other side. Hurry. What's wrong? Yeah. Hurry. Oh, God. Can I go inside here? Hmm. Now we're going to go up. Maybe there's, maybe there's a hole on the roof. Or maybe there's not. Oh, take a look at this. Ooh. It's crazy. I like that. It's kind of like in the last one. The more we use our abilities, the more they get upgraded. You know what I mean? So. Nice. Bro, look at this world. It's like completely just overtaken by, by nature. It's crazy. It's kind of like uh, in The Last of Us. Especially in The Last of Us 2, where everything's, you know, trees are overgrown, and man, I love this vibe right now. Luckily for us, it's just a video game. Because <laughs> this would be, uh, honestly, very daunting. Oh, we gotta go here, there, and jump up here. Whoa, 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 calm down there. Don't need to do anything crazy. Okay, so we've got a rope. Okay, we're gonna go up here. Interesting. No, come on. Okay, hold on, we got this. safe here we're safe good oh man we're going into the deep this is that good it's getting dark I'm now the tunnels oh god hey can you hear me i'll meet you soon here i come nothing good ever happens in the tunnels okay how do i turn on my flashlight damn it Why to look back? Right, just keep going. I have a bad feeling about this. Hello? I'm sorry, but the last time I checked, this was not a horror game. So, why are you doing this to me? Everything is clear there. Bro, look at all the bodies. Oh. Oh. God. Hey, is anybody there? Shit. Hello? This guy's gonna kill me, isn't he? Oh, shit. This doesn't look good. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I don't like this, man. Just gonna be honest. Bro. Oh, my God. It's 
locked, of course. Oh, shit. Oh. 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 Oh, shit. Oh, we're fucked. Please don't tell me I gotta run away from that thing right now. Who down really for this? me a volatile lots of those fuckers in the sewers we must get to the light quickly bit us where's me uh, uh, later we have to move <laughs> resist it it'll pass <laughs> just stay strong oh my god <clears throat> here you are we've been looking for you <laughs> He's dead to me. Didn't have it on him. Let's go! I don't have the key. I swear! There's so much happening in this game, dude. So soon. I, I'm so obsessed with this game right now. It's fucking awesome. There's the flashlight! <laughs> Finally! We got a flashlight, ladies and gentlemen. One hour into the game. There we go. And it's creepy. Fuck's sake. Really? I don't have the key. I destroyed it. I did this on my own. Both of you. Open up. We're making a shit ton of noise, man. Symptoms kicking in, and it ain't pretty. I'm about to turn, and I'm gonna kill every son of a bitch in here. No, 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 no. don't bring Waltz, not him. Oh, Waltz, that's the guy we're looking for. It's gone. I, I told So hold Obi to block. Block at the very last moment of the perfect for a perfect block, and it staggers an enemy, making him vulnerable. Okay, let's learn how to block, shall we? Very nice. Come on, sucker. Ooh, I like that. Like my drain pipe. Yep. Now I will kill you. That's right, bitch. Let's go. Oh, hell yeah. Let me see that stupid face. Oh, crap. What up, fellas? How's it going? Ready for me? How's it going, fellas? That was not a perfect block. I'm sorry. Man, I was almost at 100% accuracy. Oh, I love how their masks just come off. Ah, I got it. Bleed you out. <laughs> Got you good. Broke your spine there, pal. Oh, I think I just hit him in the nuts. That was awesome. <laughs> I'm sorry. Let's keep it rated. Rated PG-13. It's impossible to keep it rated PG here, okay? It's not happening. Never, ever. Required new combat skills, so let's check that out. 
So you can level up your combat proficiency and earn your first combat skill points. Okay, continue. So the vault kick allows you to perform a kick while vaulting over an obstacle or a staggered enemy. Hover over the uh, uh, the skill arc. Okay, so it can only be over an obstacle or an enemy that's staggered. If the enemy's not staggered, it doesn't work. Interesting. Dude, yo, hold on. Come on, kid. Double mace. Hold on, man. I gotta loot these boys. You know these boys. These actually, these boys ain't got crap. You know what? Never mind. How about anything here? What is this? Oh, I like that. Oh, look at this. You were gonna make me miss out on all this cash. How dare you? All the coins. What do we have here? Should I? Oh, this is where I would have. Wow. Okay. Who was that? There's no time <laughs> in my pocket. I left you something. What is this? A GRE access key. The peacekeepers, they found it. We cannot lose it. You were going to tell me what happened to my sister. Where's Mia? You will go to Fisheye. There, ask for a girl named Lawan. Give that to her. With it and her help, you'll learn. You will learn everything. Understand? Protect it. If Waltz gets his hands on it, the whole city, everyone will die. Hmm. Waltz? Is Waltz here? He is. Oh, they're coming. You hear that? Renegades, run. We'll go together. Take this. Let's go. Oh, nice. Fuck. There's our lost lamb. And he's not alone. Our lost lamb. We can fix that. We can slaughter him. All right, so pro okay, here we go. Parkour combat. Use vaults to increase your mobility. Run at a staggered enemy and hold RV to bolts and okay, then kick them. This is the foundation of parkour combat. Later you'll learn more skills. Excellent. This is it. <laughs> oh god, you actually hit me. Oh. oh god, I'm not doing it right. Oh nice! <laughs> Let's go, bitch. <laughs> Ow. I gotta perform three Give bolt up, kicks. <laughs> Wait, he wasn't staggered? <laughs> oh my god. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, god, a little bit too late. Come on, one more time. <laughs> Oh man, dude, that's awesome! Come on, punks. Weapon's almost broken. I need to time that better. I don't know why I'm having. Man, it's gotta be like literally at the perfect time. Looks like your mask is all sucker. Bro, oh, that's fucking insane. Ah, uh, he did. I'm gonna cut you up. Oh, man. That's right. You're the last one alive. Huh? Oh, crap. There's more coming. Hold up. Uh. Oh, this takes four seconds. Holy cow. Okay, can I go here and uh, go to the inventory? Um, where's the one that this guy just gave me? Oh, would you look at this? Can I replace it? Swap out. Yes, I can. He gave me this one actually. 
Okay, perfect. Right, here we go. Bend over. <laughs> Yo, that's insane. You call that fire? OB to perform kick. <laughs> like that? Uh. Oh my god. That does so much damage. This is excellent. We have to run. All right, let's go. Let's get the heck out of here. Let's get the fuck out. That's what I said. Zaheer, are you there? Do you have my key? It's Walt. We have to run. But I'm looking for him. You we idiot. He'll kill you if he finds you. Dylan! Fuck. Get to the vent. Quick. This way. You first. Waltz can't get the GRE key, remember? What? Let me out! I... Fish high. The one. Go! There's the traitor! Uh, I did it. <laughs> hey, fellas. Let him go. Betray me. This key is not yours. You can't. Where is it? In here. This is the end. I'm sorry. <sighs> Getting misty? It's not mean really. right hook. You're only dying. Or uppercut. Before zero hour, my grandfather raised horses. Beautiful rare breeds. I love them dearly. One day his most beloved horse fell off the slope and broke his leg. I thought Grandpa would help him. But he just pulled out his pistol and put it in my hand. He told me, you're doing it for him. Then he pressed my finger on the trigger. I screamed. I wanted my grandfather to die. But years later, I realized what must be done must be done. You leave me no choice, my friend. Oh, wow. <laughs> No. Someone's here. Seriously? <laughs> he's infected, by the way. If you see his face, he's like full of veins and shit, so. Maybe he's trying to find a cure. God knows. There we go. Escape from Waltz, uh, Waltz and uh, his henchmen. Oh! No, 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 no. Whoa! Alright, so we're going that way. Alright, going underwater. Here we go. I just hope my lungs hold up. This has been I mean, this is still the beginning of the game. Like we're we're kind of getting the hang of, of where their story is going and where it's been in the past. And we're about probably over an hour right now. This is incredible. All right, so let's see. I kind of want to fight more of these bandits. Yeah, we're in bad shape here. We're not looking good. Let's go inside. Perfect. There's got to be an upgrade eventually in the skill tree uh, where we upgrade our, our stamina. Oh, what's happening? 
This is the same thing that we witnessed in Dying Light 1, dude. What the fuck? Did we escape? Well, I think we did. I think we did. <laughs> that we did on the side quest? It is. Who the fuck is this? He doesn't have a biomarker. A what? I stupid for us to even try and do that either and just saved our life probably thought he injected something into him who knows just probably what i would have thought and we're tied up with my wraps that's great 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 excellence he's moving hack on kill him hack on kill him before i do it for you oh whoa whoa, whoa. relax breathe Seems he hasn't turned. Seems? Hakon, I don't want that here. You've come back to us. Blink if you understand. Ah! Fuck my head. Oh. You were on the verge of turning, but UV light and inhibitors pulled you back. Uh, the bat helped too, of course. Whoa. You're alive. Let's keep it that way. Guy almost kills us all, and you're chatting him up? Girls, relax. They're frightened. You almost destroyed their workshop. We need to move out. Can you walk? But I... I don't understand. Where are we going? To a safe place. I gotta get to the fisheye. The fisheye? Without the biomarker, you won't get near it. What the hell is that? Biomarker monitors the disease's progression in the dark. That's your ticket into the city. Without it, uh, stepping out of the light is sort of a lottery. You don't know when you turn. You need a biomarker, and I know where to find one. Come on. He's turning again. Relax. Everything's under control. It'll be fine, hey? You're weak. Take a minute. Drink. Seriously? What next? Maybe we should draw him a bath. Sounds pretty cozy to me, ladies. Uh, maybe next time. Get banned, Hal. <laughs> she adores me. Why are you helping me? Let's get to know each other and find out. You go first. Where'd you get all those? None of your business. You're careful. Good. You live longer. 
You a real pilgrim? Or did you steal that badge? I'm a... I was, I was a pilgrim. An hour to dusk. I'm serious, Hakon. He's not staying the night here. Here. Your weapon and your radio. Not even a pilgrim could get by without that. Come on. Let's go. Zone, and we've got a first mace. So follow hack on getting stronger. Interesting. That's a nice place. Don't get comfortable. We don't need another roommate, especially one that could rob us while sleeping. Not every pilgrim is a criminal, you know. Uh huh. You have a nice workshop here. Assembling UV lamps, huh? Yeah. You shouldn't be here. Hakan's risking our asses. Get the hell out of here. Yana hey, and me got hey. shit to do. Calm down. I'll, I promise I'm a good guy. Okay, you guys are gonna learn to love me. Everything's gonna be just fine. I'm sorry. I guess I scared you, huh? Felt better after I hit you. Or even. Yana. Aiden. What is this place? Our home. Our workshop. Our whole world, you might say. You're nicer than she is. Hey, back off. Sarah doesn't trust anyone but me. Besides, I'm a better fighter than she is, so I can afford to be more open. What do you got to say about that, huh? Huh? Can she kick your ass? She just said she could kick your ass. Nah, I'm just saying. You heard of yourself. Not Sarah didn't like you. So I'm sorry, but you and I ain't gonna be friends. Oh, well, you know, okay. Well, I thought you were nice. Uh, never mind. Infected playing card, Ace of Spades, Demolisher. What is that? That's a collectible, right? Oh, that's cool. It looks like the peacekeepers tried to emulate the tactics of old world armies to educate their soldiers about enemy threats. This card shows a demolisher, a high level tank type infected who will use anything that falls into his hands to crush their opponent. They're often covered with armor. As side effects of the mutation, they can be weakened with UV light. Wow, 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 boys. <laughs> Not bad. Where's the fish eye? The canteen is there, in the center, past the chemical dumps. Uh, I need to get there. Too bad. Only way to go is through the tunnel. They protect it like a portal to the fucking Valhalla. Near impossible to get through. It's my specialty. Where's the tunnel? <laughs> Not so fast, cowboy. You won't get far without a biomarker. You are a threat to everyone. And you've already seen how people in Villador react to a threat. Well, can you help me? You seem to be familiar with the city. I've lived in this city since before the world got fucked up. I could help you, but... You need a biomarker. You won't get far without it. Hmm. Where are you from? Pretty far, I guess. About 2,000 kilometers. Oh, shit. How the heck did you not get infected? That's easy. Didn't let him bite me. Here it's different. Here we're all infected. Heard of Haran. They isolated Villador too. Wow. They built walls. They locked us in. Turned out to be the thing that saved us. And how do you get a biomarker? Ah, uh, you can't get them. Unless you know the right people. And I do. Let's go. By the way, I'm Hakon. I'm Aiden. Nice to meet you, Aiden. Welcome to paradise. <laughs> wow. The whole, uh, okay, it's for the extended HUD. Oh, yes. Let's go, boys. Over here. 
Woohoo! Ow! Oh, you do know the moves. I was in the military. Special unit? For seven years. I even liked it, except when I didn't. For insubordination, got blacklisted and they zeroed my bank account. Wow. Ended up driving a cab. Ouch. Now the mighty have fallen. <laughs> Fuck you! At least I got to know my way around the city. <laughs> oh, come on! Um, that is not good. You're too weak. Without an inhibitor, you won't last. Didn't I smash everything in sight last time you gave it to me? That was just the first time. Oh, come but on, man. Be better if you survive, of course. Catch! Well, You're that telling me I could have died? If I hadn't given it to you, you would have died anyway. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, look at this. Lavender. Resin. Oh, we've got the goods up here. This is nice. A wallet with seven coins. That is sensational. What is that? Scraps. Hey, can I loot that crap? I thought that was lootable. Oh, well, that's fine. More scraps. More camel mill. Let's get some money in here. Thank you. Let me see if there's anything else that we're missing. I feel like I could open that up. Oh, well. So, why are you helping me? I know people are generally scared of you guys. But one pilgrim saved my life. I was a pilgrim. Now I'm infected. It'll be much harder to travel. And welcome to your new beginning, my friend. Check out this place. They're like treasure chests. Usually got good stuff in them. Check it out. I'll wait. Hmm, maybe that's why I couldn't open up the other chest. Ah, roof grooves. Groves, excuse me. Roof groves. While traversing through the Bellador, look out for the roof groves. Uh, their dense vegetation, recognizable by their tall yellow trees. A great source of honey, chamomile, and resources. You can use to craft medicine and other consumables. There's a chance you'll also find some uh, forgotten weapons there. Ooh, really? All right, let's search that up. There we go. That's what it People is. People hide a lot of things in places like this. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to cut you off, man. Oh, shit. What's that? C crystals. Someone must have stashed them here. They formed after the chemicals were dumped on us. Some believe they delay infection. Folk superstition. So you don't collect them? Sure I do. Superstitious people pay a fortune for them. And I am always happy to take someone's cash. There's one specific chest I'm after. Come on, let me show you. Alright, getting stronger. I want to learn how to slide like that, man. Nice. God, the parkour feels great. Come on, come on. Stop. So, you have an army here? I skipped it. Oh, shit, these skippers. They treat people like that, too. Watch out for them. They guard the tunnel you want to go through. Oh, I skipped the I skipped like the first little dialogue there. Because if you tap B or circle, it skips it. I'll watch out for them. I've handled these kinds of guys before. Tell me more about them. Tell me more about them. They consider themselves righteous protectors. Uh, they are good at killing infected, so you got to give them credit for that. Yeah, pretty efficient killers. Yeah, but their righteousness comes with a price. Always remember this. You either play by their rules or you're fucked. Their protection of the bazaar is more like an occupation. Hmm. On the trail, I met a lot of tough guys who talked about 
the new order, it always seemed like the same old shit to me. Yeah, it's like that here too. And the PKs are getting worse. I'll proceed with caution. Good. Though it might not help. The PK are a pain. Seriously riling up the bazaar folks. The bazaar is a box of dynamite one spark away from blowing up. Hmm. Hey, are we going? You uh, wanted to show me something? Sure, follow me. I think I will. Barely. Oh my gosh. No, I'm just gonna wait for this dude. I'm gonna wait for him just in case. Go, 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 go. Oh my there. goodness. I hope there are no surprises. Uh oh, it's getting dark, guys. It's getting dark. They are about to wake up. Quickly, open the chest. Shit. In return, we'll get your biomarker. Fuck. Thieves. Wait. No, 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 leave it. Mess up that lock and everything's fucked anyway. Oh. Enough for a biomarker? Where'd you get that? I've been all over this city more than most. But even I haven't seen working GRE equipment for years. I can't say much, but a former GRE scientist, Dylan, gave it to me. A guy named Waltz killed him. And before he died, Dylan gave me the key to keep it from Waltz. It contains important information, apparently. I hope to find out more at the fisheye. We'll have to see, won't we? Fuck me. We took too long. Plan B. Run like hell. Oh, no. Oh. What do they have on their wrist? They've got, like, red lights. Hey, then. You there? I'm okay. I'm okay, I think. We need to find the UV lamp. The bazaar. We can make it. Follow me. Quick. Oh, now we're going to the bazaar. Okay. The UV light uh, is a symbol of safety at night. It is the only certain protection from infected, so watch for it when you're being chased. Oh, here we go. <laughs> They're close. Bro, there's go been on. so much action in this game. It's insane. Ow. Whoa, dude. Oh, my goodness. Non-stop action. Over there, toward the light. Can you hear that? Woohoo! Almost there. So fun, man. A bit further. Open up. Hello. Stand in the light. Uh, Hakon, uh, come on, open up now. Hakon, a howler's coming. Oh, fuck. Biomarkers. There's no time. We've got the howler on our asses. Biomarkers. Did you hear behind us? I said biomarkers. Here. That is. He's with me. I have to see his biomarker. Let us just inside the door at least. I need to see his biomarker. How about some electronics, huh? Fucker. Open up! Oh my god, are you serious? They turned it off? Bro! I can't. It's cold. We need to get the kill here. No time! 
Run, Aiden! We're fucked! Uh, Chase is the... Okay, oh my god. Quick! They almost got us. No, 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 I'm gonna need to hurry up, man. Chase the... Oh! God, they're right on me. There's more and more of the Aiden. My boy, hurry up! God! Not far now! We'll be safe there. Bro, that is super scary. Oh, my health is lower too. We're done. Trouble loves company. I'm just, <laughs> just kicking him off. You know, I actually don't mind cutting you guys up into little pieces. Back on, get us in there. I'm trying. Killian, I know you're there. Okay, you've collected craft master resources to craft master to upgrade your parts. Is that all of them? I think what so. Is... Help me. Shit, man. What the freaking crap? These guys are crazy. Oh, we're so fucked. Oh, no. Bro, they have biomarkers, don't they? Look at their arms. God damn it, Gillian. Should have waited a while longer. Almost did. Didn't want to clean your guts off my doorstep in the morning. They've left, so can you. Oh, come on. Stop being such a bastard already. Look at this. Where did you... That's rare. Invite us in, or it'll get even more rare. Who is this? I'm a pilgrim. Haven't been here long, have you? How did you get into town? I'll tell you everything. Just let us in. I waited for a pilgrim once. He was supposed to... Ah, oh, forget it. Doesn't matter anymore. What are you up to, hack on her? I gave him an inhibitor. He survived. Are you mad? He needs a biomarker. Don't have one. Bullshit. Seriously. <sighs> Motherfucker. The hospital then. I was hoping to avoid it. 
Always looking for an easy way, huh, Hakon? I just need a UV lamp. I'll come back for you. Hold tight. Hakon, why are you helping him, huh? Remember when we used to help people? Me? Sure. But I doubt you do. Stay here and rest by the lamp. Don't listen to that dumbass. Idiot. We used to help people, remember? Sure, I remember. <laughs> so, Killian's hideout, safe zone. A fucking cabbie and a mother of mercy, all in one. But you can cook. Everyone around you said that's what you should do, cook. Life would have been easier. No knife runners, no hack ons, no problems. But no. You wanted something else. Higher fucking causes. So. And you can just cook. Hmm, what can I rest? Uh, ask about the biomarkers. Biomarkers. Why are they so hard to get? Because they're complicated devices. Hell, the factories that made them have been out of commission for years. Biomarkers are key to blood. They can't be reused after someone sinks with it. Without them, the infection runs unchecked. Like what's happened to you. That's why people pay a fortune to get a new one. All the money and crystals they have. Fortunately, me and Hakon found a place where they can still be made. But what's wrong with Hakon giving me inhibitors? Kills most people in seconds. It's a powerful drug. Most can't handle it. But I survived. I said most. So don't get excited. Just be careful with them. You and Hakon, you known each other long? Too long. What did he mean when he said that you used to help people? We served together in a special... Ah, uh, doesn't matter. Ancient history. Where can I rest? So you just got into town. What brought you here? This ain't the promised land. Far from it. I need to get to the fisheye. And Hakon's helping you get there? You seem like a good kid, but... Take my advice. Don't go doling out trust like penny candy. Hell, how do you know you can trust me? Okay, enough jabber. Go to sleep. Nothing to be done till morning anyway. That's a nice little bed up there, dude. That's awesome. What do we have here? Double mace. <laughs> All right, so we're just gonna go to sleep. Not creepy at all. Find me. Oh shit. HQ here. Hospital right needed. Copy. Yeah, very funny. Did you make it? Almost. Biomarkers mm. are at the GRE hospital. I'll be there shortly, but to get the job done, I need you to join me. Where should I go? With Killian's door to your back, you'll be pointing right at it. Hold the line. Oh god. New story quest. Markers of Plague. So meet Hakan at the hospital. Alright guys, so I think we're going to call it quits here. So far, right now, within the game, I've loved every single second of what has been happening. Of the backstory, of Aiden, the characters. Um, the voice acting is so darn good in this game. And... On the next episode, part two, we should be going to the GRE hospital, which I think it's going to be extremely, extremely creepy in order to hopefully find one of those bands, which is going to allow us to go into the into the bazaar and kind of be accepted within the culture of this world that we're now in. Right. I'm super pumped. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys want to see daily multiple episodes of Dying Like 2, make sure you guys drop it a like. And on top, it does help me out. And a huge thank you to you guys and Techland. 
the early access. So I hope you enjoyed. I'm excited and I will catch you on the next one.